On a cold, dark, cloudy night, almost 20 years ago, NASCAR lost its champion, Alan Kowicki, in a Bluntville pasture. On a flight from Knoxville to Tri-Cities, Kowicki and three others were in a plane that slowed and crashed just before final approach at Tri-Cities Regional Airport near Bluntville. All four on board were lost. The plane appeared on a normal glide slope and then uh, had a, an extreme nose-heavy attitude and then began a downward spiral impacting the ground. Nicknamed Special K in the Polish Prince, the Wisconsin native, who was an engineer by trade, left a huge void in NASCAR. The reigning Winston Cup champion was also the 1986 Rookie of the Year. He won five races in 75 starts. He was admired by all since he rose to the top of NASCAR by becoming the first car owner and driver to win the title. Allen was a, a great champion, a great competitor, and a good friend of everybody's. I think the Tri-City area also shares in that, that, you know, it was, it happened there. It happened on a race weekend or going into the race weekend. I don't think everybody really wanted to be there that weekend. I think they wanted the weekend off to kind of process the tragedy that had just unfolded. In the days following the crash, NASCAR fans around the world mourned the passing of the number seven Hooters driver, and in fitting tribute, his hauler made one last pass around the world's fastest half mile over. The sick feeling that we all have in our stomach will be here uh, today, tomorrow, the whole weekend, uh, and for a long time.